Hello, sweet team. Welcome back to my channel. This is Sweet Ajele and I am back with another quick lunch or dinner idea. We're making beef with broccoli, one of my favorite Chinese food, but making this at home, you will find it is way better than take out. Let's get started. Here I have my nicely cleaned beef. To that, I'll add some garlic salt onion powder, ginger powder, a little bit of baking soda to tenderize my beef and some cornstarch. You may add some all-purpose seasoning or any seasoning of your choice, but the salt in the garlic is good enough for me. I'll mix everything together, cover it up and allow it to marinate for about 20 minutes. While that is going on, I'm going to prep my thickener. I have about a tablespoon of cornstarch in here. To that, I'll add some of my stir fry sauce. I'll mix everything together until it is well combined and I will set it aside. Then to a pot, I'll add in some coconut oil. You may use any oil of your choice. And we're going to go ahead and fry our beef. And you wanna fry it on high heat because you don't want it to release too much juices, okay? I'll fry this just until it is nice and golden brown and then I'll set it aside. In the same pan, I'll add some coconut oil and we're going to go ahead and stir steam our broccoli. So once I've added the broccoli, I'll add some salt to taste. I'll also go ahead and add in some water, which will cause it to cook quickly. I don't want the broccoli to be mushy, so I am not boiling it at all. After stir steaming for about a minute, I'll go ahead and add in some carrots. Totally optional, but I like the pop of color it adds to this recipe. I'll stir steam this for an additional 30 seconds. You may cook this longer if you wish, but I want it to be nice and crunchy. So I'll set it aside and in the same pot, I'll add in some of my homemade stir fry sauce, which I'll leave a link to in the comment section for you to check out. As soon as it begins to heat up, I'll add in my stir fry sauce and cornstarch mix. Give it a quick stir cook until it thickens up beautifully just like this. And then we'll go ahead and add in our meat and vegetables. Stir everything together. Drizzle some sesame oil over it. And when I tell you this is better than take out, you better believe it because, oh my goodness, I outdid myself, if I may say so myself. <laughs> Every single body really enjoyed this dinner. And the next night, they wanted a repeat. And I know your family is going to do the same. Now, all that is left is for us to serve and enjoy. And we are pairing it with rice. But trust me, you could pair it with potatoes. You name it, it goes well with it. Thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and are inspired to try the recipe. Until I see you in the next one, stay safe, keep loving each other, and remember that the love of God and family is lies great 
greatest blessing. And guys, ke unamini uchemi sweet mahabo tu. Bye y'all.